yeah, I have been having way too many lash hauls. Let me know if you like how many lash hauls I've been having because I'm thinking, like, now that I work at Lush, I might just do, like, show you a ton of my purchases all, like, at once. Like, if I do, like, a monthly haul or if you like these hauls that have, like, a medium or normal amount of stuff. Like, let me know what you think in the comments. Um... Yeah, so I went shopping like I told you guys I would to buy more Father's Day stuff. Sorry, I just, you know, hit my bag with my lipstick. But I apologize that this video is going to be up after Father's Day and you might not be able to get some of these items in your shop. However, you might, who knows. Um, but so yeah, I went to Lush and I got some goodies. I got a pretty decent amount of goodies while I was there. So yeah. The first thing I got is the Dad, Super Dad Bath Bomb, and I know I already showed you guys one of these, but of course I had to get one for my dad since the last one was for myself, and so it's just so cute because it says Dad on it, and it looks like, I mean, it looks like a comic. It's just perfect for dads. Um, so yeah, got that for my dad, and then for my husband from my dog because you know she's you know he's her dad I decided and he loves Lush to get him you know some of the Father's Day stuff too so I got him one of the dad um super dad bubble bar or bath bombs what am I saying she also got him a mod father which I have already told you guys about in my last haul this just has the most amazing, like, Brazilian orange oil scent. And, ugh, it's so pretty. Boys love orange. <laughs> um, so, yeah. Got those things for my dad and for my husband. The next thing I got is Whipstick Lip Balm. This lip balm is actually being discontinued, which is why I decided to pick it up. Because I love this lip balm. I think this is the very first lip balm that I tried from Lush. And none of them have lived up to how great this one is but I understand that not everybody likes it uh, because it's a chocolate orange like flavor and I love things that are chocolate orange but yeah so Lush is bringing out like in the North America um, tons of new flavors which I think are already available in the UK I'm not, I'm not really sure but they have like a passion fruit one and it's all in the Lush um, catalog if you have one of the catalogs they have like all the different flavors it's like a key lime pie one I think um, but anyways along with all these awesome new ones coming out uh, you know somehow to go so whipstick is being discontinued so since it's my favorite I'm like okay gotta get oh, <laughs> gotta get one so that like I can at least have it for you know until it expires in 2017 I will be good on some whipstick till then the next thing I got like kind of melted a little bit on its way home with me um, I already have shown you guys this and I have a demo of it and I love this so much I can't talk so much I can't talk enough good things about it this is the melting marshmallow moments bath oil bath oils I feel like are so underrated they make the most luxurious beautiful like feeling water like if you want something that's super moisturizing and really awesomely scented the bath oils are like where it's at like they are I put it in the wrong way there it goes it was like facing like this way you know like like this um anyways <laughs> I got it but this one smells like snow fairy if you love snow fairy scented things that bath oil is would be so perfect for you plus it's only like 350 so it's like super inexpensive and after you get out of the bath I have a whole demo and review so you can go watch like that whole thing if you want to hear a lot about it um, but after you get out of the bath it feels like you just put like a massage bar or like lotion or something like all over your body so it feels so good and you're scented like snow fairy like who doesn't want to smell like snow fairy <laughs> so this next thing is wash that man right out of my hair shower gel um, this is guava and fig and this is a shower gel that is not my like all-time favorite scent at all like I wasn't really planning on getting this however it's just gonna go so perfectly with the bath cocktail that I am going to do tonight so and you guys probably have already seen that video it is the um, what's it called orange is the new bath cocktail that I am 
do it or I did. I was telling my manager at work about that. I was going to do that and she's like, you have to get wash that man right out of my hair. It'd be so funny because it's like an all women's prison. So like, wash that man right out of my hair. I'm out of women's prison. Uh, <laughs> so yeah, it was her idea and I was like, that is like, that's just a really great idea. So I decided to pick this one up. Even though it's not my favorite fragrance, I'll probably um, use it for my bath cocktail and then pass it on see if my husband wants it or if not my sister or mom love you know everything from Lush too so somebody will get good use out of this even if it's you know not for me <laughs> and then the last thing I got oh I almost dropped it um kind of melted a little bit it's so hard with massage bars um to in Arizona you know for them not to melt but this is also for my Orange is the New Bath bath cocktail um, because, I mean, I love this massage bar so much. I didn't even say what it's called. It's called From Dusk Till Dawn. This massage bar has the most, like, invigorating, sexy, like, like citrus smell. Like, it's such an amazing scent that I feel like is really underrated at the stores. Like, you should definitely go and smell this if, um you you know are at the store because it smells so good but it's like unlike any other citrus scent and it's melting in my hand of course but I love massage bars I'm probably like thinking about doing a whole video on massage bars and talking about how great they are because I think since massage bars are something that like are like the founders of Lush like created like they are like something that not very many companies have so I think that's really cool about them so I think I might do a whole video all about massage bars so if there's any like massage bar that you want to learn more about let me know and um, in the comments and I will be sure to talk about that one because there's so many I can't you know talk about them all but <laughs> I'll talk about my favorites and if you are interested in a specific one I can talk about it but yeah, so those are all the things I got from Lush. Um, most of it being not for me this time, but you know, I love giving gifts to sell. So. Anyways, go check out my Orange is the New Bath bath cocktail that I um, did. I will post like a link to it because I mean, even like in real time right now when I'm recording this, I haven't taken that bath, but I bet it was cool. Um, but I'll already have that video <laughs> uploaded because I'm gonna upload that one tomorrow. Okay, so confusing. <laughs> Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this haul. Be sure to give it a thumbs up and let me know if you like my hauls. This like kind of condensed style or if you'd rather me do like a ginormous haul when I have a ton of stuff. Just let me know. <laughs> Anyways, um, be sure to go and follow my Instagram account because my Instagram account has like, you know, current up to date like pictures of like my baths of the night. I love doing a bath of the night post whenever I take a bath, which is pretty often. <laughs> um, and I always post about my Lush hauls and about my videos when they go up. So that is the perfect place to follow me to get updates on when like a new video is going up and all that kind of stuff. Um, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed this haul and I will talk to you all next time. Thanks for watching. Bye. Mwah.